looks very spectacular. It's not even 5 a.m. We are starving. So we're just eating our little toasties from Costa. And we're all in matching tracksuits. Classic us. Actually, we touched down probably about an hour ago, didn't we? But we finally got to our. Um, well, it's not an air. It's not an Airbnb. It's a. Um, apartment. It's a, ho a hotel, but it's like an apartment. I'll show you guys in a second. It's so cute, and the guy was so nice at reception, oh, wasn't so cute, he? Wasn't he was like he? such a little angel. And also, we're not technically meant to check in until like two. Um, and it's only. I know. I know. I was trying to. Ready? I was like, oh, I was trying to decipher what he was saying on the phone because he was speaking yeah. Italian, <laughs> and I was like, mm, sounds like bad news. Yeah, <laughs> me too. <laughs> clearly, clearly, we're not good at languages, guys. <laughs> but yeah, so the let's check in. It's only like eleven, so we're here nice and early. I mean, we did get up at the crackaroonie of dawn, didn't we, girls? We just can't not wait to get an aperol spritz down there, <laughs> can we, ladies? It's just like the That's best gonna thing. That's going to be the drink of the whole day. I know. Last year's was sangria. Well, was Sangria. Sangria. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, if you guys watch the Palmer Nova vlog, if you're long-term followers, it's the same trio, <laughs> the same iconic trio. Yeah, actually get next year. Yeah, right? I know. Well, we're, yeah. this is an annual thing, girlies. Oh yeah, and I'm gonna show you guys the room before oh. we make it messy because it's so cute. So this is the entrance when you walk oh, in. Yeah, it's a cabinet, and then there's a really massive bathroom. Loads of room to get ready, put all of our stuff. We have a little kitchenette, not not that we're going to be cooking, but you know, just nice to have it. And then there's a little sofa bed. And then we have this cute little area where you can sit down. And then it comes around to our bed. Sorry, I'm It's all right, babe. It's all right. And our two little wardrobes. And it's just so cute. And it's got a chair there as well. Milan holiday. Start here we here. are! Woo! Woo I'm so glad that I spent hours steaming all of my clothes before I packed them because, as you can see, they have no creases on them whatsoever. Do you actually steam it and then roll it up straight away? No, I let it cool down. Oh. I know, it's not my first time. Oh. Well, it looks like it bloody was my first time all of my clothes are like creased. so creased Same. what the hell we're gonna have to see if there's an iron because oh, this lovely. this is a situation Ooh, we found an iron guys and a full-on ironing board as well and rachel has like never ironed anything i like so she's like terrified so of the iron <laughs> so all is well all is saved my things now are not completely creased Anyway, we're going to get ready now. I'm gonna have a quick shower, I think. Because if by magic, the girls are ready. Where's Marley? Oh, she's gone for a week. We're all dressed now and feeling like we've Melanified ourselves. Yes. Honestly, like we were set, like, I don't know if you were thinking this, Rach, but I was literally like, I can't just pull on like the usual holiday outfits like they need to actually be cool yeah because everyone in milan is really cool and everyone tells you that but it's like effortlessly cool so you have to look cool but also not like you try too hard yeah like i feel like we look quite Chill. I don't know how we look. Yeah. Mine don't really we match. Look cool. I don't know how we look cool. I don't know how we look. I don't know how we, we look really cool. Look cool. Right, Rach, your OOTD con. So, Scott is from Zara. Lovely. Bodysuit is from Zara. Lovely. <laughs> Denim jacket, Zara. She's a Zara girl. Well, I actually cut this myself. So oh. it, was, it used to be like down here. And you cut it. She's a DIY queen. Yeah, fashionista, you know. Um, this is from Zara. <laughs> oh my god, Zara, Zara, stop. Zara, Zara, Zara. And New Balance. New Balance, which I have on too. And Ray-Bans. And Ray-Bans. And then I've got 
this like satin skirt that I haven't worn yet, but I literally love it from Warehouse of all places. And then this top is from Zara. It's such a good little top. And I've got my new balance on. Oh, shiny in the sun there. And then Mally, what a surprise! Zara! <laughs> This yeah, is literally yeah. a Zara trip. So we're at Adenola on the way here. And now, we're, and now we're Zara during the day. See you guys in, well, wherever we end up next. Let's just, let's see you guys with an Aperol in hand. Aperol, thanks. Yeah. <laughs> On the way back from the metro, you'd be surprised how wet you can get in just a few minutes. We are literally soaked. Um, it's literally like all on my face and all on my makeup. We're going out, I mean, when are we actually going out for dinner? What time is it? Okay, we're going out for dinner in an hour and a half. My skirt is like, I don't know if you can see, but it's like so wet. Oh my God, my hair is so wet. Okay, this is my, this is my dinner look, guys. <laughs> So we literally just ran home in, it was like hammering it down, wasn't it? Oh my God, my eye. What is that? Did that just came off my eyebrow. <gasps> Wait, why is that? Oh my God, my that eyebrows are it soaking wet. My hair's not too bad now. Oh my God. I had my jacket What over. the hell? Why are my eyebrows like storing so much water? <laughs> <laughs> right, we'll see you when we're looking a bit more presentable. Oh, you look presentable. I, I don't. I always oh, look in that, I need to look in this. Yeah. Bye guys.
morning guys it is the next day and we're all ready we've got makeup on hair ready and it's actually pretty early it's like 8 40 or 8 50 or something like that because we are going to lake como today and we're super super excited because the weather looks quite nice today someone told us to get the train to varena instead of lake como and we've seen loads of really nice tiktoks there so it does look so stunning so i think we're going to go there um and then get the ferry to bellagio which is like the place that you always see on instagram with like the cute little streets and i feel like we're ready for that dose of like Real. holiday town vibes that's very much our vibe isn't that's it? our vibe getting a gelato strolling Ooh, along so gelato i missed out because we didn't get that last night <laughs> much to rachel's dismay so yeah so i'm gonna head to the train in like a couple of minutes you want to see the so we missed the train um we waited in the ticket queue and it took a really long time and then the woman was like actually if you wait in this queue you have to pay more basically we missed our train but there's another one in an hour so we come to this like really cool bit of the station it's literally like a, a full-on food market oh my god the places look so nice the pastries the little cakes i i swear to god i could have just like taken so many things these really like these look so nice what are they called again um Mar Maurizio or something but it's like cream and then it's got strawberries chocolate and inside a bun like it looks so nice and then i got this croissant which has cream in it so mm, so excited to eat these Oh my god, it's so bright. I'm gonna put my sunglasses on. I can't even see with my sunglasses We have on. made it to beautiful Verena and it is. I mean, we've literally only walked, we've walked probably like 200 meters yeah. and it's so stunning. Like we're sat on a bench right now. Look what we can see. Absolutely gorge. We're sat on this bench. We just finished the pastries that we bought this morning and we're thinking of grabbing an Aperol because you can get a takeaway Aperol at that little shop for like five euros and then I think we're just gonna walk around aren't we because it is stunning beautiful bellagio Gorgeous. oh my god like it literally doesn't feel real and we're on the hunt for maybe a lunch spot some gelato we've already had an aperol we've done we're ticking things off the list so yeah i think we're gonna look for a nice little lunch place hi guys so why is my hair like this right so we had a slight lava not a major one but we still had fun this whole time we thought we were in Bellagio because when we got off the ferry clear as day this guy said to us the ferry guy was like Bellagio and he said it like, we were like three yeah. times so like Rachel was like yeah and he said it again to me and I was like yeah so we got off and you know in this beautiful place which looks you know like Bellagio so we were like yeah this is stunning and then we were like trying to find these stairs you know the Instagram stairs and Rachel just happened to put it on a map and it was on a full on different island <laughs> to where we were. We were in, and we were in Menage. And Ma Mally's still trying to tell me that we were in Bellagio. Yeah. Well, we, just, like, we not clearly not. just, we trusted that man too much. Yeah, so we had a nice little stop off at I mean, Menage. Like, got to experience. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. And now we're gonna go to Bellagio and we're, first point of call is to find something to eat because yeah. we are starving.
the ARM show. <laughs> we're we're just getting ready in the room. I think we left you at Verena, maybe. We got the train back from Verena, which was kind of stressful. Well, not that stressful, but like we had no clue what train we were getting on because there was literally no information anywhere. And else. we kept asking all these people. Well, we didn't. We were like seeing people asking. <laughs> We were too scared. Nobody knew. Like literally nobody knew. Everyone was just like, mm, we hope it's the right train and just like jumped on. Anyway, it was. So it was fine. Just come back, had a little bit of a chill, bit of a scroll, bit of an Instagram post as you do when you're on Holly Bobs. And now we're gonna head out for a, like a chill dinner. <laughs> everybody we are back at our favorite spots having another croissant today I've got a an apricot one because I love apricot croissants and the girls have got chalky delights we are so tired today I don't know why but this morning we were like zombies um, I feel like it's just the early flight catching up with us but that makes it the perfect day for some R&R &R. so yeah we're gonna go to the spa after this once we've had our croissant we're gonna get the train and head to the spa and we're so excited because well firstly I'm just excited to relax I don't know about you guys but also it looks so cool on TikTok I've seen it all over social media so really excited for five hours of just bliss at the spa so yeah I'm gonna enjoy my croissant and then see you there some pizza we're all finished at the spa we're just sitting at a bench eating this delicious pizza and look how we cut it up like that's just so much easier than normal and it was so sweet he also gave us a free focaccia bread like just to try it's like a proper big one as well isn't it yeah. it's so nice so honestly we were so starving so this is hitting the spot completely mm. yeah I feel like we've been craving this all day. Mm -hmm. mm. Hello, it is a long time later and the girls are ready. Oh, We're ready to go. And we are all matchy matchy. Mally, come forwards. Come forwards and Rach. Show in the mirror. We've, we've gone for a black and green theme tonight. So Mally's got the green blazer, I've got the green little scarf, black dress, and then Rach got the black dress. So we're triplets tonight, as we are like, to be honest, most of the time, we're literally like triplets. <laughs> we, all the same. we actually are the same. Um, but yeah, so we're gonna go for food. We're gonna go to a pasta restaurant, which a few people recommended because they make the pasta fresh in front of you. Although I'm actually not that hungry right now. Mm. I think, I feel like when we'll see I feel it, like I'll be able to eat for sure. Oh, also, update on the spa, Gallies. What did we think? What did we rate it? Oh, it was a good one. It was good. It was sensational. It was amazing. There were so many rooms. Like, I've never been to a spa like that in a city centre. I've never been to a spa like Well, that. I've never been to a spa like that, full stop. But, like, oh my god, it was just like endless rooms. There was a whole outdoor bit, there was an indoor bit, and there was like a bit underneath, like the bit where the rain falls. Oh my god, it was so cool. Like, yeah. Loads to Defo do. recommend if you go to Milan. It's really cool. And we did the five hour. Um, day, which for us was like more than enough time, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So yeah, absolutely stunning. Highly recommend. And yeah, we now we've got our zen back. Come, come <laughs> on, ladies. Yeah. We've got some proper R and R. So yeah. yeah. Right, off out to celebrate now. See you in a bit.
morning guys from the last morning in Milan, sad face. We're just packing up the room. I'm gonna try and leave our luggage here because we actually have the full day here. Our flight's not until like 9 p.m. tonight. Um, so we're gonna try and leave our luggage here because this is near the station that we need to go from to go to the airport. The girls wanna go to the Starbucks because apparently it is sensational and someone said it was the best vanilla latte they've ever had in their mm. life and i don't drink coffee but for you guys i can appreciate that mm. so yeah i'm gonna go see that do a bit more exploring see what's in the center because i feel like we only saw the cathedral the other day so we're just gonna see what's around and yeah have a bit of a chill day Delayed. Our flight is delayed, so I'm just having a Pokeball. What do we rate the holiday, ladies? Yeah. 10 out of 10 as always. Because so we make it 10 out of 10. Hello, guys. It is two days later i think i just wanted to close off this travel vlog milan is officially done ticked complete i feel like me and the girls had milan on our little bucket list for so long so it's so nice that we've finally been able to tick it off i had such a great time i also think we just went for the perfect amount of time like if you were going to go to milan i recommend like don't go any longer than four days because for us that was just the perfect amount of time to like do all the things that we wanted to do we had so much variety because we got to see the center then we had the spa day we also went to lake como so there was like such a variety there and yeah had the best time thank you so much for watching this vlog i hope it gave you a bit of an insight into milan if you're thinking of booking a trip there it's such a nice city break and you can actually get it for really cheap i mean i think we paid for flights and hotel like 300 but i've seen people get it even cheaper than that so yeah maybe just like keep an eye on when the cheap flights are coming don't forget you can follow me over on instagram i've posted loads of milan content over there and i'm not gonna lie i'm pretty proud of the pictures i got like i can't lie so yeah head over and follow me on instagram to check those out and i will see you guys in the next video bye